This episode of Own the Gray is brought to you by I Am. Discover your unique talents, realize your potential, and align to your path. Take the first step to uncover your life purpose by visiting deborahjones.ca slash courses. Getting older can sometimes affect our ability to move around. We may feel less steady while walking, and this can lead to falling. There is something we can all do to prevent this. Keep listening to Discover the Secret. Mental practice is a rehearsal of a physical skill without movement. You visualize or imagine yourself going through the actions, but don't actually do them. Mental practice helps you prepare for performing an action in reality. Studies show that athletes who engage in mental practice performed better than those who didn't. Musicians have found that practicing new musical pieces in their head help them learn them faster. Patients recovering from a stroke found that mental practice helped them regain movement in affected limbs. It works by allowing the brain to interpret the visualized actions in a similar way to if you had performed them physically, forming new connections between nerve cells and muscle cells. These connections are called neural pathways, and they allow us to learn and adapt to new skills. These connections become more established with frequent practice, which is why daily mental practice is so effective. The best time to begin is now. Let's do it. This meditation is one of a series of empowerment meditations designed to retrain the brain. Studies show that mental practice is effective for chronic recovery after injury. The brain can rewire new neural pathways around damaged areas, and these new connections can strengthen with daily activation and continued use. Daily practice can reduce mobility impairments and improve functional recovery. Used with meditation practices such as progressive muscle relaxation and breathing techniques, it also promotes relaxation and cultivates expanded awareness. According to wisdom traditions, listening to guided meditation helps you focus on the present moment, allowing limitations of the mind and body to shift their focus onto new possibilities. In this mental practice, we'll imagine what it feels like to be walking easily and effortlessly. We'll begin by focusing on your breath. Allow your eyes to gently close and take a deep breath in, feeling your lungs expand. Hold it in for a moment, and then breathe out. Take a few more deep breaths, relaxing your body as you breathe out. Continue to breathe slowly and deeply. Now, We're going to awaken your muscles. Do only what you can. Focus on your hands. Tighten and squeeze both hands. Keep holding as tightly as you can. Now slowly relax, releasing all tension. And again, squeeze both hands. Keep holding as tightly as you can, and now relax them. 
Once more, squeeze, hold, and release. Good. Now focus on your shoulders. Try to bring your shoulders up to your ears. Hold them there. And then release. And again, shrug your shoulders. Hold them. And then release. One more time. Shrug your shoulders. Hold them. Then release. Great. Now to focus on your arms. Try to shake your arms. Try to move your wrists and hands in circles. Try to wiggle your thumbs. Try to wiggle every finger. Loosely shake your arms, wrists, hands, and fingers. Then stop and rest your arms. Now, we'll awaken your core muscles. Do only what you can. Tighten your buttocks. Tighten your hips. Tighten your stomach and your back. And keep holding as tightly as you can. And then slowly relax. Releasing all tension. Try to wiggle your hips and torso. Then stop and rest your core muscles. Now we'll awaken your leg muscles. Do only what you can. Tighten both sets of toes. Tighten both feet, both legs. Keep holding as tightly as you can. And now slowly relax, releasing all tension. Try to move your hips. Try to move your knees. Try to flex and point your toes. Try to wiggle every toe. Then stop and rest your legs. Now take a deep breath in. Feel your lungs expand with air. Hold it in for a moment before breathing out slowly. And again, deep breath in. Hold it. And release. One more time. Take a deep breath in. Hold it. And then breathe out slowly and completely. And now, become aware that your brain and your body are communicating well with each other. Your brain and body are flowing with energy. Your brain is awake and alert. 
Your body feels alive yet relaxed. In this mental practice, you will remain seated or lying down with your eyes closed while imagining yourself walking on different surfaces in familiar surroundings. When your mental practice is complete, we will bring your awareness back to your present moment and then you can open your eyes. But for now, keep your eyes closed and your body relaxed and let's begin. In your mind's eye, see, feel, or know that you are standing in your home at one end of a hallway, or in the largest room of your home. Notice the layout of the familiar area that you're envisioning in this moment. The walls, the flooring, the furniture. First, You will be imagining walking through your home. You're about to take a walk through the area while avoiding obstacles and furniture. Focus your attention onto the straightest, longest route. Listen carefully to learn how we'll take this imaginary walk. And remember, do not actually stand up. This is an activity for the mind only. Bring all of your focus to your body. Notice how it would feel if you were standing still at the end of the room or hallway in your home. Remember the feeling of balance and freedom of movement. Now, see, feel, or know the texture of the surface you are standing on. Is it soft carpet, a rug, or hard flooring? Notice how it looks and how it feels under your feet. Notice how secure and balanced you feel as you stand on the floor that you've created in your mind. Your hands are down at your sides and you are confidently balanced over your two feet. Feel the pressure of your feet against the floor as you stand with even distribution of your body weight on your two feet. Feel a slight bend in your knees. Feel your body remain upright over your hips and legs, completely at ease. Feel your head, neck, and shoulders balanced with your body. You are able to gaze forward and in any other direction without losing your balance. Continue to stand completely still in that place, breathing deeply. You are confidently balanced on two feet as you stand in the room. Listen carefully as I explain how to take a walk through your home. If you currently use assistance or an assistive device to walk, like a cane or walker, you're not going to use it in this mental exercise. In this exercise, you are able to move the way you used to when you were fully mobile. Still standing tall, 
see and feel yourself taking a large step forward. And as you do, feel your weight move onto that supporting leg while the leg behind you swings forward to take the next step. Keep taking one confident step forward after another until you are walking confidently along a flat path in your home. As you walk, notice your arms swinging freely at your sides and the smooth, relaxed rhythm of your stride as you walk along your clear route. When you get to the end of the room, confidently turn around and continue. Don't stop walking. When you get to the other end of the room, see and feel yourself confidently turning around. Continue to experience yourself walking smoothly and confidently through the home. Don't stop walking. If you can picture the layout of other rooms in your home, you may walk through those rooms too. Continue to walk around your home, turning when you need to turn to avoid objects in your way. While walking, notice how well you are clearing your feet off the ground. Notice how your body slightly rotates to help your arms freely swing with every alternating step. Notice your heel hit the ground first each time you put your foot down. Notice how your back leg always swings forward for the next step. Notice that you never feel your feet dragging over the floor because you bend your back knee high enough as it moves forward. Continue to walk around your home just as you remember you once did in an easy, natural pace. Doesn't it feel good to be walking in your familiar home without help and without holding on to anything at all? Now, slow down and stop walking. Simply stand in one place wherever you ended up in your home. You may notice your heart is beating a little faster and that your lungs are taking in more air. How did it look to walk around your home? How did it feel? Did you feel more confident the longer you walked? Did you enjoy walking? Great job. Take a deep cleansing breath. Next, you will be imagining walking in a park. See, feel, or know that you are standing in a beautiful park. 
with a sidewalk or a clear path. It could be a park that is familiar to you or one that you create in your mind. It's a sunny day. You're standing next to a park bench with your hand touching the wooden bench. You look around and see grass, trees, and flowers. You smell the clean, fresh air. You hear the birds singing or children playing. Now listen carefully to how you're going to walk through the park. In this exercise, you'll be walking through the park yourself, unassisted. In your mind's eye, see, feel, or know that you are standing in the park, on the path. You take a large step forward and feel your weight move onto that supporting leg while the leg behind you swings forward to take the next step. Keep taking one confident step forward after another until you are walking confidently on the path that runs through the park. Notice your arms swinging freely at your sides and the smooth, relaxed rhythm of your stride as you walk confidently along the path. Continue to experience yourself walking smoothly and confidently through the park enjoying everything that you see as you walk by. Don't stop walking. See your surroundings change as you continue to walk. If you approach a curve or a bend, walk with the path of the curve. Feel your arms swing and your body rotate with every alternating step. Continue to walk around the park at a comfortable pace. Now, slow down and stop walking. Simply stand in one place wherever you ended up along the path. You may notice your heart is beating a little faster and that your lungs are taking in more air. How did it look? to walk around the park. How did it feel? Did you feel more confident the longer you walked? Did you find it enjoyable? Great job. Take a deep cleansing breath. Next, you'll be imagining walking around a store. See, feel, or know that you are standing in front of a shop that you know very well. 
It could be a grocery store, a hardware store, a clothing or thrift store, or bookstore. In your mind, create a picture of the store that you would like to stroll through. Now imagine that you've just walked into your familiar store and you notice all the features inside. The size, the aisles, the flooring, the checkout area, and even the type of lighting. What kind of things do you see when you look around you in all directions? Take a moment to notice as much as you can about the layout of the store. Now listen carefully to how you're going to walk through the store. You're going to locate two items. Think about what you're going to look for first and where it might be in the store. Decide what direction you're going to walk to find your first item. Still standing tall, see and feel yourself taking a large step forward and feel your weight move onto that supporting leg while the other leg behind you swings forward to take the next step. And keep taking one confident step forward after another until you are walking confidently on the floor that runs through the aisle. Notice your arms swinging freely at your sides and the smooth, relaxed rhythm of your stride as you walk. Continue to experience yourself walking smoothly and confidently through the store. Noticing everything around you. If you approach a corner, walk to follow that change in direction. Walk a little longer at a comfortable pace, continuing to look for your item. Seeing your surroundings change as you continue to walk. Don't stop walking until you get to the area that you expect to see the item. Once there, slow down and stop walking. Remain balanced in one place, confidently standing still. You see what you are looking for on your left. Take a confident step and reach forward with your arm to bring the item close to you. Hold it in your hand. Now we'll look for the second item in the store. Start walking again. Feel your arms swing even while you hold the item in one hand. Feel your body continuing to rotate with every alternating step. Continue to walk around the store at a comfortable pace with a natural rhythm to your stride. Keep walking, easily making turns when you need to turn. Now slow down and stop walking. Remain balanced in one place, confidently standing still. 
you see what you're looking for on your right. Take a confident step and reach forward with your free arm to bring the item close to you. You are able to hold both items. Now, walk towards the cash register at the front of the store. See yourself confidently walking all the way to the cashier at the front of the store. When you get there, simply stand in one place in line for the cashier. While you're waiting, you may notice your heart is beating a little faster and that your lungs are taking in more air. How did it look to walk around the store? How did it feel? Did you feel more confident the longer you walked? Did you find it a joy to walk? Great job. Take a deep cleansing breath. You have now finished practicing walking in your home, a park, and a store. You're satisfied with the strength, stamina, and control in your legs to walk for all the activities in your daily life. Now we're going to return back to a heightened and alert state of consciousness. We'll start by slowly reawakening your arm muscles. Tighten and squeeze both hands. Keep holding as tightly as you can. Now slowly relax, releasing all tension. Try to shrug your shoulders and release. Try to move your arms. Try to move your wrists in circles. Try to wiggle your thumbs and fingers. Slowly reawaken your core muscles. Tighten your buttocks, your hips, your stomach, and back. Keep holding as tightly as you can. And then now slowly relax, releasing all tension. Try to wiggle your hips and torso. Now slowly reawaken your leg muscles. Tighten both sets of toes, both feet, both legs. Keep holding as tightly as you can and then slowly relax, releasing all tension. Try to move your hips. Try to move your knees. Try to flex and point your toes. Try to wiggle every toe. Now take a deep breath in. Feel your lungs expand with air. Hold in the air for a moment before breathing out slowly. Remain relaxed as you listen to the sound of your breath. Noticing your chest rising and falling.
feel all the muscles in your body invigorated with energy and awareness. Your muscles feel different. Take another deep breath in. Feel your lungs expand with air. Hold it for a moment before breathing out. Your brain and your body are communicating well. You have newly discovered power. You have control over your body. You are aware of how to move so that you can participate in all the things you enjoy doing. You feel empowered to keep trying again and again and again. Take one more deep cleansing breath. And then slowly open your eyes and return to your surroundings. You may feel very relaxed as you come back to awareness in your room. Take some time to enjoy the feeling. If you must get up, give yourself time to sit up and stretch, move your muscles, and become alert before getting out of your chair or bed. This will help to reduce the risk of losing balance or becoming lightheaded from getting up too quickly. Now remember to practice this every day to retrain your brain and achieve the best outcome. Well done. Let's do this again tomorrow. Go to ownthegray.ca to follow us and listen to more great episodes. Or you can listen on Apple, Spotify, Google, iTunes, Amazon Music, Stitcher, and more. This episode of Own the Grey is brought to you by I Am. Discover your unique talents, realize your potential, and align to your path. Take the first step to uncover your life purpose by visiting deborahjones.ca slash courses.